and it is opening night for the 2024 Milwaukee Film Festival, which offers 15 days of more than 300 screenings to enjoy. The festival is celebrating its sweet 16 by bringing a historic gem back to life. Sydney Orr spoke with those putting on the event. She joins us live this morning to share what's in store. Sydney, good morning. Good morning. I met with some of those programmers here inside the beautiful or Oriental Theater, but there is a bigger surprise in store. They say they spent like seven months gearing up for this, watching hours of film, eating a lot of popcorn, but they are excited to announce that the Downer Theater will be back and running for this year's Milwaukee Film Festival. And they say acquiring it was kind of a long, complicated process that they accomplished just in time for the 16th annual Milwaukee Film Festival. The first screening at the Downer Theater will be Friday. Friday afternoon right after an official ribbon cutting ceremony and all are welcome to join in on that and they say it'll be the grand start to one of the larger film festivals around the country over the next 15 days 300 films will be screened so from each of the venues themselves to the people behind the scenes of those locations making it happen the excitement is truly just through the roof being here at the Oriental, always amazing, of course, but then being able to have like a big ribbon cutting ceremony for the downer and bring everybody back to that historic gem in our city will be the best. And then obviously we love the Time Cinema and the Avalon Theater too. So uh, yeah, we're really excited to get started. During the show, each film, each reel gets loaded up onto the projectors and every 20 minutes we're basically switching from one reel to the next manually. So it's like a finite art of timing and calibration, which is just a lot of fun to do. The ribbon ceremony for the Downer Theater will be Friday afternoon, but if you want to catch opening night right here at the Oriental Theater tonight, that is at 6 o'clock, and it's kind of a two-for-one deal because if you buy your ticket to the first screening tonight, you'll also have that to get into the after party at the Villa Terrace, which is going to be a great time, so they say. So it's kind of a win-win situation. If you love films, you love having a good time with the community, this film festival is the place to be for the next 15 days. But for now, reporting live at the Oriental Theater, I'm Sydney, your Team G4 News. Like a two for one special. Late night. All right, Cindy, thank you.